Hey everyone, it's Random Noob coming at you with some Zen ranked gameplay. Picking Zen here. We definitely got a pretty balanced comp. Looking at how the draft going is going pretty far. I'm assuming they have Rock, Carl, uh, Sadhawk, and FRZ on their team. We haven't played much ranked yet this season, so obviously our MMR is pretty low. But it's it's cool to be a, a part of these games, even though we haven't played that much at the same time. Um, ooh, Dredge. That's going to be interesting. Dredge is definitely really hard to push through on Barn on this map. I think I think this map, I know everyone low ranked loves banning Dredge and they love like just taking him out of the game, but I think on this map especially, it's actually worth. Cuz just cuz Dredge holding down Barn area and just just spamming his his broadside makes it so difficult to to get in there on him. We do have a decent team against him. We have stuff that can kind of disengage against him really well. Um Pip, Zin, Obviously, Khan pulling in, uh, Makoa hooking him as well. It's a lot of uh, mobility away from his teleport, which is strong against a, a dredge player, right? If he can just stand around his teleporter all day and, and easily get him down, dredge is so much stronger than, you know, being able to dive him or whatever. Rocks on the, the cast. Ooh, it is FRZ got in. Uh, yep, called it right. And then Bacon's their healer. Seems like a pretty solid game pretty solid Ooh, i love playing zin and ranked should be fun should be fun man the ranked games during the day have just been so good and like the queue times have been great too this just proves that it's not really a matchmaking issue it's really just a player base issue right if we all start playing more ranked and crossplay maybe brings in more players as well i think it'll be really good for the ranked ecosystem right because like just seeing these games just proves you know that there are quality games to be had it's just the players need to be there the players need to be quality and i think that's a good thing for like my youtube that's what i want to do i just want to like bring the average skill level of the player base up right the average skill level of the player base average knowledge of the player base is higher naturally games will be better and that's the whole plan of the youtubes the whole plan looks like bacon is DC'd, so it's gonna be a little bit till we get in here. It's all good. It's all good, man. Hopefully he comes back before the game starts, though. It'd be rough if we get like such a great game and then they have a Grover bot. But to be fair, Grover bots are probably the best bot in the game. I don't know if any of you guys play bot games. If the other team has a Grover bot, yikes. That's that's a tough bot game. That's a tough bot game. I think we're gonna try out our. Uh, deck that we kind of change around i don't need i don't need the super dash what did I, where is it here it is i run up and smoke five and i reduce the time so that you're you're in below but you have more speed so you basically cover the same distance but you're in the fight a quarter uh 0.4 seconds faster because your billow ends quicker it also makes your billow cooldown start earlier as well which is pretty good and then i just put blade dance too so it's a little bit different but we've been testing it out it seems to work pretty well um let's go cauterize Okay, their Grover's back. That's good. So we're playing a full, even match of Paladingos. I think we're going to start off going mines or left side. And just spam. Spam early. They have a lot of spam as well, so we got to be careful. We just don't really want to stack up against a dredge. You know, you don't beat a dredge by stacking, that's for sure. Oh, uh, those! How did those hit me, man? I'm one. Got to reset. We're all really low. Yeah, I don't want to be playing on this side of the map. That's for sure. Get out of here, rock monkey! I'm coming to throw it. I'm gonna heal out of combat for a second. All right, we're still even, actually. Oh, that's not good. 
I probably would have died if I didn't hit that. It's all right. We were really down. I we had to make some kind of play, but it's fine. We we did decent. As soon as we get our cots and wreckers online, this game will be a lot easier. It's kind of rough that they got terminus on this map. This is like an insane termi map. I'm here, paying. It's an insane Grover and Termi map. Nice hook. But we do have decent counter with the Koa. So it's not bad. Nice, we're getting a decent we're getting some good push here. No! That was scary. No, the cripple. That was... Okay. Yeah, I, I gotta remember that Grover can cripple. But they got no push. And we were... Whenever we were down someone, I'd get a little bit more antsy. And sometimes I need to just play slow. Like, this meta, you really just want to play slow. Like, if you're down someone, there's a really good chance you're just gonna keep losing. So, you just fall back for the most part. Nice trick in. That was a really, really good girl girl. I got caught too, it's pretty big time. Tony, you're probably gonna have to ult here, buddy. Alright, they have no dredge, it's pretty big. I can flank them here. I forced their heals out, so the tanks don't have heals. Stop shooting me, Rock! Get out of here! Alright, that was pretty solid. That's a that's a tough D. And we, we saved our both our tank ults, that's huge. And our chickens, that's really big. It's actually really big. It should be as long as we, you know, collapse uh, collapse on our chickens and get good value out of our ults, it should be a pretty easy point fight. Zin is definitely not the easiest in the team, but we can make it work, for sure. Like, Terminus is obviously going to stop a lot of my poke. Dredge, we're going to have to dive on and just make his life difficult. Once we get caught threes, this game is so much easier, though. Just so much easier. And Payne's already got record two. That's big. I think we do the same thing. I think holding left side was the play. I, I think as soon as we go right and just get into dredge spam, it's going to be a lot more difficult. Nice. Good picks, boys. Ugh. Shoot the con- or shoot the- whatever. The dredge, please. Nice. Good job, guys. Oh, no. We got- we actually got another pick. The Throner, what you doing? Shh. Okay, Dave. The Throner. If I would have killed that dredge, I could have got my billow reset back, but. It was really hard because Rock was there covering him pretty well. Is Rock flanking? I hear you flank, buddy. Nice. They have no dredge. It's pretty big.
Did I just get 1v1 by a, a Grover? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Actually, I got Calamity Blast. All right, yes, I didn't get 1v1. Woo! Yikes, that would have been bad. Can't get 1v1 in the vid. I easily could have ulted him and lived there, but I don't think it was worth. I want to use my ult on this Terminus. Chickets? Did we get anything? Nice! The dredge TP is really far up. I want to collapse on that. What? Oh my gosh. OP. The Throner just killed the Termi. Unlucky. Zenalt's definitely really strong against Dredge. Can we just reset team? We're just staggering right now. tough poke fight when they have terminus siphon like that they said we do no damage and they do normal damage we have caught three that's big it's a big buy we don't have our koa or con ult, so that's kind of rough but pain already has his chickens back he's he's definitely he's building chickens super quick Okay, so they're gonna expect me to go lower mines because I did it the last two rounds, so let's switch it up. How do we want to switch it up though? We don't have mass riding, so we can't get anywhere quicker than them. Like their dredge is mass riding too. Hmm. I guess we just go left. Rock is mass riding as well, which makes it kind of rough. I think we just play slow, go under mines again. I had to billow before I got crippled. Wow, Rock is so far back. Damba? Hello? Oh my god. I got ult now. It's big time. Okay. I guess we needed that kind of Kappa. <laughs> good mid, guys. Alright, we have really good mid control. Rock's already dead, so we want to aggress super hard here. I'm going to hold right side this time. Left side is just really open. If I can hold up, up right here... Tanks. Nice fan. That's actually a big pick. I'm gonna push cart. While everyone's dead, might as well get free push.
Like, literally, all we need is a decent Koa ult and chicken here. Oh, did Thona hook someone? I'm with you, brother. Enemy killing Enemy double kill. I need it. Enemies above Enemy rampage. No. Almost. All right, we got master riding. Is Haven worth getting? Yeah, I think master riding too is probably the best buy. It's really strong on the mid. Really strong right here. I think we I think we looked to alt here if we get a pick. Oh never mind. Throwing just got killed. Fifteen seconds remaining. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, I'm dead. I did not think well, I did not expect them to be over there, I'm not gonna lie. I guess the throner was probably over there, so they all pushed that way. I couldn't tell from that far away. Alright, that's fine. We got all our ults for the mid. Jeez, this game's so close. How much Rezil do they have? They don't have much Rezil because they invested in a master adding and other items. Rezil on Dredge is a really smart buy, I think. I mean, we don't have, like, a great comp for it. Like, obviously, it's only good against chickens in our comp. But, like, if they had an Ash or something and it just stops the knockback on you... Pretty strong against like Cassie knockback as well. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna go the same way just because I'm the only one with master adding two, so I should be able to get there first. I mean, their dredge has it, but. No, why'd you chicken? I'm here with you! I'm here with you, buddy! I'm here with you to throw it! Uh, I forced out the barrack ult. It was actually a fine below. I'm gonna stay high ground. I think high ground's the play. I'm here, buddy. Cassie's up here as well. I'm gonna try to try to keep behind this turn. I'm on their heels now. Alt. Oh, I was gonna ult in the air for the BM. Ooh, that that last mid was clean. It was clean. We had so many triple yomis, quad yomis. Oh, it was a clean game. That was just a real nice, close, honest ranked game right there. Rock played really well. FRZ God's actually a nut. Payne had some nice chickens too. Just all around well played by everyone. Zinn is just such a weird champion in this meta, I'm not gonna lie. It just He feels so strong, but at the same time I feel like I'm not doing anything at the same time, you know? Like, we definitely had good damage for a flank. And and in terms of flanks, and as far as flanks go on this map, there's, there's really no no good ones, right? There's really not many good flanks. Look at the dam Like, the backline damage just seemed to pop off. Pan and, and Rock both popped. Both did a ton of damage. Oh, 30k off healing from a pip. Like, our cop was just super sustainy. Definitely really strong. I thought the Terminus pick was going to be tough to deal with. It kind of was, but... We, we definitely forced out his ult at inopportune times, which is really strong. Like, I'm the last bin when I ulted him, and I did get some help from my team. So you ended up going down, which was was, was really good. Because forcing his ult out there just basically meant we we won, we won the game, right? Because turn me ult's their strongest ability for the mid cap. And Dredge, honestly, like, on his best map, 
on a map I think he might be okay to permaban on, he didn't really do that good. And FRZ God's a really strong dredge player. So the fact that a dredge is only doing 13k more damage than a Zin with how I'm playing it, um, it's definitely something to keep in mind, you know? Well, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this Poggers ranked gameplay. And uh, I will see you in the next vid. Peace.